thought so. Sound asleep, all of them. Measuring. Oh, you're up. I thought you were still in bed. Morning. I suppose everyone else still is. Mm. Uh, <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, you look very uh, uh, sporty. This book you gave me is great. I never knew there were so many things living in the garden. Diane, mm. I said I suppose everyone else is still in bed. What? Oh, no, we've been up for ages. We thought you might like a nice lie-in, is it Saturday? Lie-in? Today's the day I start training. You still want to go through with it, then? A quick drop of orange juice and I'm off. But I've got to keep fit. I've got to start training. Well, don't overdo it. Me? Oh, we don't have no chance. Well, where is everyone, anyway? Mike and Kate are in the garden measuring up. I think Mike and I might have different ideas about the garden. Mm -hmm. Where's Dan? In a room, tidying up a comic. She's not very pleased. I said it was time she threw some out. There must be hundreds of them up there. More next week. I'll keep that one as well. I don't seem to have thrown many away yet. No, Kate, not like that. You stand at that end and I go to this end. OK? Stop there. Stop there. Right. Right. Kate, you're doing this on purpose, aren't you? <laughs> Have you finished tidying those comics up yet? Uh, sort of. Come on, then. It's very important to warm up. Dad needs me. Have you finished the... This is a job for Super Dan! We'd better see what's going on. Love it. It'll be just like a Spanish courtyard. Oh, what? You know, a Spanish courtyard. A patio, paving, different coloured bricks. I thought here we could have a lovely stone archway. Well, what about grass and flowers? Oh, no, no, that's boring. Everybody's got grass and flowers. We want to be different. That's what worries me. And over here, I thought we'd have a nice big red bricked barbecue. Just imagine it. <laughs> We can. We've got to have grass and flowers and places for creatures to live. Creatures? Animals. We've got animals, dumb and deep. I mean in the garden. Bugs and bees and birds in the trees. Oh, is that all? Who wants a garden full of bugs and bees? I do. We all do. The garden needs it. It's all in here. Mini beasts. You don't want to believe everything you read. Anyway. We want to be different from everyone else. We don't want a garden full of insects and, and mini-beasts. What about the birds? They won't come if it's all pavings and bricks. Well, we could have a bird bath. A bird bath's no good on its own. Birds need trees and bushes. No grass or flowers, no animals. You'll drive them all away or kill them with concrete. Well, I didn't want to do that. I... Just like a Spanish courtyard. I thought we all would. Well, I've got to go down to the builder's yard now and see how much all this will cost. I'll see you later. A Spanish courtyard is fine. Yes. In Spain. He's very set on the idea. Then it's up to us to change his mind. Show him what we could lose. Huh? Come on. What about training? Training can wait. They're novice. Hmm. Once they get used to it. Bugs.
by treasure that we found in among the weeds in the world that's in the garden in the secret garden world what will we find what do you think we'll see there are words lies creeping on a fallen tree and underneath the leaves that are on the ground there's a little black slug and a snail to be found in the world Well, that's without your colour bricks, of course. We'll have to order them specially. Oh. You look very nice, though, judging by your plan. Very, um... Spanish? That's it. That's the word. Spanish. Very Spanish. We could deliver this afternoon, if you like. Apart from the bricks, of course. That's a lot of money. We could have a small lawn and a couple of trees. Hmm. Oh, so, so, sorry. Hmm. Trees might be nice. Spanish there, huh? How did you get on? There's a lot to think about. And there's a lot to think about here as well. You can open your eyes now, Dad. What's all this lot? Just a few of the other creatures who live here. Hmm. Worms. I dug those up. I bet you did. The ground's really hard. Wood lice. They wander the old bits of wood the builders left. I like the snail best. Nan found him. Caterpillars. That means moths and butterflies in the summer. Spiders. My favourite. <laughs> What's this? Just water. It is now. But when we build a pond, we can have fish and hundreds of water insects. Mm, a pond. Now that is interesting. And, uh, what have we got here? I did that. Nan says if we have a pond, we might get some frogs. If we leave food out, we might see some hedgehogs. And then there are... Uh, now, hang on, everyone. What about my Spanish courtyard? Oh, all right, then. Come on, let's go for it, then. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, that's settled, then. And there's still some time for a bit of training. Come on, Kate, we better put these creatures back. I'll help. Comics. Mom! Dan, comics. Mom! Danielle. But Super Dan didn't have to tidy up any comics. That reminds me, I think I've got a book on garden ponds. I'll just go and see if I can <laughs> find it. Come on, we'll put these worms back. But I want to keep those. Well, you can't, they wouldn't survive. But I want to, and I want to see what they do. Kate, they live in the earth. They need food and water. Well, we can give them all that and still see them. Well, I suppose there might be a way. I know how we could do Danielle, it! Danielle, tidy up those comics! How? <laughs> <laughs> 